In this presentation, you will be learning more about supporting details. Let's begin. I deserve a raise. This is your main point, your topic sentence. If you were the boss, what would you say to this statement? You probably would ask why, wouldn't you? Think about it. Why do you deserve a raise? You would need to provide your employer with specific reasons or supporting details which explain why you should get a raise. Without supporting details, you state the main point, but you don't make the main point. How will you show, explain, and prove? Details, examples, evidence. Think about it this way. Good support uses sensory images and explains providing specific relevant details. It also uses evidence from outside sources to prove a main point. There are two types of supporting details, primary and secondary. Primary details are the major ideas that back up the main point. Secondary details back up the primary. First, you need to give examples of why you deserve a raise. This can include attendance, experience, and that you are a hard-working employee. Now that you've chosen your primary supports, you need to add primary details for your supporting ideas. Your secondary support gives examples, details, and illustrations that further explain your primary support. Take a few moments and examine this graphic illustration. Notice how we added explanations for each primary supporting detail. Can you think of some specific details, examples, or illustrations we can use as a secondary supporting detail? Once again, examine the graphic illustration. Notice how we have added explanations for each primary supporting detail. Notice how the secondary details back up the primary details. For example, under attendance, we added that the employee is never late and rarely absent. Notice how we have added explanations for each primary supporting detail. Read the passage silently as I read it aloud. I believe that I deserve a raise. First, my attendance has been very good. I am never late and I have rarely been absent. In addition, I have five years experience working here and I have advanced from entry level to middle management in a short period of time. Finally, I am a hard worker. My evaluations show that I follow policies and procedures to the letter. My supervisors will tell you that I'm always willing to go the extra mile. For all of these reasons, I hope you will consider granting me a raise. The supporting details add evidence to persuade and convince a reader here. Hopefully, you've noticed how the supporting details help to flesh out the paragraph. Irrelevant details are supporting details that do not provide support for the main idea or primary details. Consider this example. Florida is great for vacations. Scan the supporting details and determine which one is not relevant to the main idea. The answer should be impressive schools. When vacationing, most people would not consider schools a determinant. Review this outline. After reading it, determine which detail is irrelevant. Did you choose the right one? You should have stated that college tuition is expensive does not belong in this paragraph. Read this passage silently as I read it aloud. 
After reading it, determine which detail is irrelevant. Disneyland is the greatest theme park in Southern California. The rides range from thrilling to relaxing, so there's something for everybody, no matter their age. Restaurants of all kinds can be found to accommodate every taste. There are many other state attractions near it. Each and every land has its own theme and feel to it. A day spent at Disneyland is a good day. Which detail is irrelevant? You should have stated many other state attractions are near it does not belong in this Read this passage silently as I read it aloud. After reading it, determine which detail is irrelevant. My neighbor Wanda is the craziest lady in town. She only comes out at night to look in people's windows. Newspapers from decades ago fill her living room to the ceiling. Loud singing noises can be heard from her house every morning. My other neighbor Jake thinks she's weird. A very strange smell is coming out of her garage. Little kids fear her. Which detail is irrelevant? You should have stated, my neighbor Jake thinks she's weird. All other details explain how Wanda is eccentric, and this detail does not. Now that you have finished learning about supporting details, please return to the module and complete your other Let's Practice activities.